We start this hour with breaking news. One person is dead and another is in critical condition. This follows a crash and vehicle fire that took place on Interstate 565. Now, this happened this afternoon near the County Line Road exit in Huntsville, and this is video from the scene when the vehicle was on fire. Now, News 19's Lindsay Smith joins us live near the scene of that wreck. Lindsay, what can you tell us at this point? Well, I'm out here on I-565 between exits 8 and 7. Take a look at the scene behind me. The Huntsville Police Department says all traffic from the interstate is, as you can see, cars are backed up on 65 heading west. Now, Huntsville Police say all eastbound and westbound lanes, with the exception of one, are blocked due to this crash. Now, according to our Greenbrier cameras, traffic on the east is backed up to Greenbrier Road, and on the west, it's backed up around Research Park Boulevard, so think before the Madison Boulevard exit. Right now, police are in the process of diverting this traffic onto County Line Road. The cause of the crash has not been determined at this time, but officials have confirmed that there was entrapment. Again, John Webster with Hemsey has confirmed that one person was pronounced dead at the scene. Webster says another victim has been taken to Huntsville Hospital Trauma Services and is in critical condition. Now, no word on how long this area will be shut down, but officials are asking that you avoid the area and, of course, find alternate routes. And we'll keep you up to date with any information that we receive on air and online. For now, live in Huntsville, I'm Lindsay Smith, News 19. All right, Lindsay, thank you. And of course, we're going to make sure that you stick with the News 19 for the latest updates. As we mentioned, traffic is still backed up and slow going. Yeah, this is a live look from our weather camera near the Greenbrier Road exit. And you can see traffic basically at a standstill there on Interstate 565. So if you know anyone getting ready to head out or they're heading home from work right now, please let them know to take an alternate route or expect some serious delays. Of course, we'll keep you updated on when this wreck clears and the road clears out on air on whnt.com and on our news app.